Next concept is westernization. See, understand this. Desanskritization means I am coming, I am Brahmin. I am coming out from a Brahmin community. It can be Vaishya, it can be Kshetriya, it can be Vaishya, anything. But when I am coming from my caste status to lower, it's called as desanskritization. That is, there is a Brahmanical model of desanskritization. Means Brahmin is coming down. Whereas Sanskritization, what? Brahmanical model of Sanskritization means any caste becoming like a. In Sanskritization, the name is given on, given on role model. Desanskritization, the name is given by which community who is coming down. So desanskritization is that community which is. So the desanskritization means a Brahmin can become a Vaishya, Kshetriya, Shudra, or also he can become a Britisher. He can also become a Britisher. So when he is becoming a Kshetriya, Vaishya, Shudra, his social status is coming down. But he is becoming a Britisher, he is coming out from the Brahmanical fold, but becoming like a for example. Indian civil service, which is conducted by the British India, 98% of the aspirants are Brahmins. No reservations, no. 98% of the aspirants are Brahmin. Means a Brahmin himself understood that he has to become a civil servant. That is the reason if you see all the secretary level officers in the central secretariat or in the state secretariat, the names will be Nair, Mudalayar, Sharmas. Ojas, all Brahmins will be in the higher. Means what? Now they are in the higher status. Means 40 years back, they recruited. 30, 40 years back, they recruited. Why only they recruited? Only they have awareness. They understood that the next model is westernization. The next model is for social status is from liberalization, privatization, globalization, which happened. Because of reservations and because of liberalization, privatization, globalization, the first section of people who understood the life is there in America. 1990 to 2015, 90% of the visas, 90% of the people who went to America are from upper caste and Brahmin community. They are fast in quick in adopting to the changing trends for their social state. You tell me till 2020, a person, my son is studying, my son is in America. Slowly, slowly it is coming down, but still the social status is associated with the person who is there in America. America, son in law, yes, please, will come with Bharat. Is there social status? Example, those are the first people, Brahmins and upper caste are the first, first people who wrote GRE and went to in the same way. Again, from Brahmin, Kshetriya, Vaishya, they understood. Now I have to emulate what? British model. Why? Because now the social state is associated with what? British. Westernization. Westernization is a concept which evolved from criticism of Sanskritization. You are telling only Brahmanical model for social, stage, social change. There is other model you didn't discuss which is called as it is there in the criticism of Sanskritization. Sanskritization to explain the social change in Indian society. In Sanskritization, MNS, MN Srinivas was criticized because of understanding only Hindu caste groups as a more secular theory, westernization was proposed. Now what? A Muslim can also be westernized. What is westernization, sir? See, western clothes is different. Our westernization, which we understood up to now is different. This westernization is different. This westernization is given by MN Srinivas. This is called as anthropological Westernization. What is anthropological westernization or immense universe westernization is? 1800 they consolidated their power and 1947 their power was end. Because of 150 years rule of British, because of 150, approximately 150 years rule of British, what are all the transformations happened in India is called as westernization. Westernization here means not just Cloths or materials or, or Donaldization or Peaceization, it is not called as Westernization. What is general Westernization? McDonaldization, Peaceization, KFCization, these are all called as our Westernization. But this is not that Westernization. This Westernization is 
because of 150 years rule of british what are all the social change happened in india is that i will be discussing now how it evolved up to now it is only the sanskritization or in the hindu social if i become like a brahmin then only my social status will be but now i changed who mn sin was saying no 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 britishers also are having higher social status so other caste groups also changed their social status westernization is defined as a change is brought about in indian society and indian culture as a result of over 150 years of british rule that means lower caste groups and upper caste groups moved in hierarchy by emulating western model of living what is western model of living the model of living which is brought by british into india is called as whereas western model is identified higher than brahmin model whereas western model is identified as more than brahmin model here western model means what british who were been the accountants for the britishers brahmins who were been the accountants if you see old movies britisher will be there one accountant will be there like allur ramalinga He will be like a Brahmin working with British. The accountant will be Allur Ramalinga means what? Accountant. So he also emulating what? The lifestyle of? So it is not just a Brahmanical emulation. More than Brahmanical emulation, it is British emulation. Now, I am speaking in language, you are understanding in our language. Emulation of what? British. British model. This is British model. This is not our model. So, if we are, I am adopting Sanskritization means Brahmanical model means we, I should talk in Sanskrit, you should understand Sanskrit. But we are, I am talking in English, you are understanding in English means we crossed Brahmanical model and we are, we adopted what? British model and it got consolidated. And it got consolidated. Western became high social status. British model became high social status. So I am adopting British model. It includes what? Changes in values, changes in institutions, changes in technology, changes in ideology. Values got changed. Technology got changed. Institution got changed. Ideologies got changed because of British. For example, values sati was banned by britishers sati what is sati what is sati after the death of the husband the wife the wife will be jumping into the pyre of husband means there is no life for her after the death of husband who banned it british and it continued it is a value system which is present in British, is adopted in India. Ideology. We don't know democracy earlier. Democracy was there in British and British when they came to India, they also brought democracy. Parliamentary form of system, institution. We don't know parliamentary form of system. We adopted parliamentary form of system from where? British. Technology. Railways. Who gave us railway? Railways are technology. Who gave railways? British. We don't know post, we don't know telegraph. We don't know mechanization of farming. Who brought us? British. So technological change, value-oriented change, ideological change, institutional change. From where we got this? From westernization, from British model. So a Brahmin adopted values of British. A Brahmin adopted values of British. So who are having these values, who are adopting these institutions, who are adopting these ideologies, who are adopting these institutions, they believed that their social status is elevated. So there we understood Brahmanical model, Kshetriya model, Vaishya model, Shutra model. Here it is not about the models. Here what we are adopting, what are those? Values, institutions, technologies, ideologies. Who gave this? 
Westernization also called as Europeanization or Occidentalization. Again, you are telling European, sir, again, not only British came, we got colonized by French, we got colonized by Portuguese, we got colonized by, colonized by Dutch for some point of time. So it is the Europeans. So the Westernization can also be called as Europeanization or Occidentalization. Westernization is a process whereby societies come under or adopt Western culture in areas such as industries, technology, law, politics, economy, religion and philosophy. You tell me. Christianity is because of? Christianity entered into India because of? British. British. One big religion. Now, a big religion which is giving a huge target to the local religion like Hinduism or Islam who is giving big competition Christianity is giving big competition how the Christianity came because of British, British. westernization can also be compared to acculturation and enculturation so in these two concepts are there acculturation and enculturation for example acculturation means because of some circumstances Without my wish, if I change my culture, it is called as acculturation. Enculturation means because of my wish, because of my choice, if I change my culture, it is called as enculturation. I like my mother tongue language. But the world is English. Opportunities are in English. So what I did forcefully, I am learning English acculturation because of the circumstances when i change my culture is called as acculturation british did acculturation how indian civil service examination will be in only english language you know till 1974 also indian civil service exam after independence 1974 also the exams were been conducted only in english then after hindi added then after 22 languages which are present in the eighth schedule of the constitution are there very recently, it was only English language. Whether I want to become Indian civil servant means first what I have to learn? Acculturation. But I love my mother tongue, but I am not because I want to become a civil servant. Acculturation. Enculturation. Oh, opportunities are more. My son or daughter should get more job. They have to be in the competition. So I want to change. Why? Because language is a part of culture. I want to change the culture. Intentionally, voluntarily, by wish, if I change it, it's called as enculturation. So, two types of social change happened because of British. One is called as acculturation. Acculturation and enculturation. So, westernization can be by Technological changes. Railways is a technology. Posts is a te technology. Telegraph is a technology. Technological changes. What are all the technological changes we have today is brought by British. So technological changes which we observed, which we noticed in our Indian society is by Introduction of modern technologies in agriculture, transportation, communication, industrialization led to the emergence of new middle class and upper class. New technology is a major source of social change. Yes or no? Technology is a source of social change or not? Engagement will happen. Bride will sit. Groom will be in video call. Beside the bride, groom will be sitting. Engagement completed. A social change. Once upon a time, if we are inviting marriage means compulsory, a person will come personally and give the card. Then what happens? Slowly, slowly system changed. In spite of that person, another person came. Slowly, slowly WhatsApp message came. Now WhatsApp message also no time. Keeping like one status. I didn't see the status. Social change. We are accepting it. New technology is changing and we are accepting it. Rocky festival is very near. There is a chance that she will come or she might come 
or she might send in whatsapp so when she send in whatsapp i will also send money in whatsapp taking a photo and means what social change new technology is a major source of social change new technologies do not change societies by itself understand this this will be useful in your essay also new technologies are not responsible for social change rather it is the response to technology that causes mobile phone is not changing us our response to the mobile phone is whatsapp technology is not changing us our response to the whatsapp is we changed britishers bought a technology and our response to technology has changed the society so technologies are means how we adopt eventually the social change mobile is a very good instrument in spite mobile phone today's mobile phone is a revolution when compared to 11100 6600 motorola this much big phone today's phone is more revolution everything is present in mobile phone but that mobile phone will change our social according to how we respond to that technology so understand that technology will not change our response to the technology will change britishers brought mechanized farming because of which for the first time we adopted it we accepted it because of which for the first time plantation crops were grown mostly of people who belong to vaishya group they did this form of cultivation this mechanization led to huge profits hence emerged as a class above that is the reason you know sir nowadays brahmins are not dominant no then what happened economy started playing major role then what happened politics played major role now one shudra is there for example sc is there he is an mla whether his social status is higher or not whether he will go or not economical person who is having more property but he is not a brahmin is elevated whether his social status is elevated or not upliftment through education lower class movement and legislations upward mobility also came the legislations like don't discriminate lower caste which are brought by britishers had made them to grow so lower caste also started emulating the lifestyle of western model and their social changes value oriented half the population women were motivated to pursue education to occupy occupation equality liberty was been added to indian social system who promoted women british yes british was british was so much positive for the education of women british were the first people who opened girls schools girls colleges then our social reformers also worked for it like raja ram mohan roy ishwar chandra vidyasagar ranande mg ranande jyoti ba phule savitri etc 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 they fought but british are the people who should give no who are the decision makers british so what value system they had in british the same value system they also gave to us because of that social change the phenomenon of westernization does not follow any one specific pattern across societies as a degree of adaptation and fusion with western culture will occur at varying magnitudes within different communities means what this value system will not be uniform this value system will not be uniform some communities adopted other communities didn't adopted some communities adopted other communities didn't adopt like kshatriyas are very rigid more than brahmins you are women you should not get education so women didn't got education in kshatriya community rajput community there is brahmins yes they understood women should be educated they gave education to women so blindly as i told you in technology it is a technology which will be not responsible for social change our response to technology, technology. similarly values which are given by the british is not responsible for social change how the communities responded to the i am giving something whether because i am giving you will no you have should also or mother used to tell 
you also same school the neighbor also same school same food same tiffin box almost everything i did you are last rank he is first rank what i did it is not only the values which are given it is about how we specifically the extent to which domination destruction resistance survival adaptation or modification affect native culture will differ following inner ethnic conflict so this value system like christianity is a value system which is given by the british how i adopt it depends upon my value system it depends upon my native culture it depends upon my native way of living so according to my adaptation my survival my resistance i will be taking these values so it is not just because of the values which are given by british it is because of how the communities have responded to the values hence there is social means we are analyzing they gave the values we also responded but not equally we responded according to the community native culture brahmins understood the next big thing is english so i have to give english our people so now we means lower caste people they understood that now we are sending our children to the school first we will send to telugu medium school or or indigenous schools or like hindi medium school we will send later on we will think about they are fast forward hence the social change nowadays everyone are entering into the is there, whether there is a delay or not or uniformly we changed no whether uniformly we adopted no answer for westernization is not uniform why because the people adopted the people adoption of magnitude is not similar one people adopted quickly some people didn't adopted people come from villages to study at hyderabad or delhi whether everyone will get the rank no who are serious who are adoptable who understand who are practical what is next who they think they will change so it is not just the technology it is not just the values our indian society also responded hence there is social mobile phone is there in pakistan mobile phone is there in afghanistan but in mobile phone in pakistan afghanistan now taliban society is banned now so they are unable to get the technology they are unable to know the technology whereas the parallel country pakistan there there is freedom is there so they can use a mobile phone there is growth is there both are there how they respond is important so values technologies are given by british india also adopted but varying magnitudes that is the reason one are fast forward other is slow one person is getting rank in first attempt another person is getting sixth attempt Tina Dabi is never a role model. I think Tina Dabi, you know, Tina Dabi is never the role model. 2018 or 2019, All India rank one. Unfortunately, she became very popular because of two things. One is girl, other is she is from a Sikh community. But she don't deserve it. Why? Her parents are Indian Engineering Services. Already they are into the service. From her childhood onwards, she was been driven. She was been driven. So in the very first attempt, she got the rank. adaptation is quicker one of our student is there sharath he got 374 rank st category he got ias he come from very 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 menial background he took attempts he took time so how they adopt so the change will happen according to adaptation values next is institutions economic institutions which brought free trade new education institutions replaced traditional sanskrit education grassroots level democracy led to inculcation of all caste groups legal institutions lead to legal empowerment of citizens and also led to eradication of social evils so the institutions were been brought by whom today we are following indian legal code which is also called as civil procedure code or civil code or indian penal code simple Indian Penal Code is divided into two: CPC and CRPC. Civil Procedure Code and Criminal Procedure Code. Who gave this? This is 1861. Who gave this? British on recommendations of which committee? Maculis Committee. 
means who gave these institutions to us british we are following it we are following it we are following it our children are studying in st anne's st anne's st mary's st joseph st thomas who gave this british institutions are also gave by ideologies like parliamentary form of democracy secularism peaceful foreign diplomacy with other countries these ideologies empowered the individuals to evolve socially politically economically and psychologically which resembles he is higher in attributes to compare to brahmins ideological parliamentary form of democracy so ideologies also came borrowed from british hence ideologically he is so egalitarian liberty oriented education oriented scientific oriented civilized form so the brahmin also thought that some people are there above me who are those british hence the british gave four things one is technology values institutions evaluation mn shiva's concept of westernization was criticized you are focusing britishers as the best model which is ethnocentric so you mn sinvas as you studied in oxford university you have links with british so in your writings it is very clear that you are elevating british like anything so it is something which is ethnocentric in nature which we are not going to believe it is criticism why because it is not only the british french also there you forgotten about french portuguese also there you forgotten about you are talking only about it is ethnocentric means you are greater i am great is called as ethnocentric the name was the name westernization is just and another name for i told you desanskritization means leaving mine leaving mine and coming down or coming up leaving mine is called as desanskritization so in westernization what i am leaving mine and becoming what british so leaving up to leaving what it is called as we can compare it till i leave it is can be compared with desanskritization i leave and adopt a british model then it is called as yes sir no did not take into account france portuguese dutch colinda criticized for neglecting non hindu caste groups again you focused only on hindus you are telling that brahman is becoming west or kshetriya vaishya shudra is becoming west what about muslims yogendra singh pointed at the irrational emulation of western lifestyle and ideologies in the process of westernization western model had some impact on socio political economical cultural fronts which are more of advantages than disadvantages but however but blind adaptation may lead to ruining of our actual culture so we should not go for blind adaptation of western culture if we go for blind adaptation of western culture it leads to ruining of our own yes what you told might be correct like institutions values technology ideologies we borrowed but it doesn't mean that our local culture is insignificant so we adopted it according to our culture and what is useful to our culture we changed it for the sake of empowerment of our people hence there is a social change that is westernization theek okay? hai